Welcome out everybody, this is Chris Germano, aka the Real Binary Master. I'm going to share with you guys my analysis on XRP USD, XRP USDT, and I want to bring attention to uh, two different things. For the most part, I've been doing and following my analysis on Bitfinex because the broker I use, um, or was using for the majority of the time, um, it was very closely correlated to uh, Bitfinex's price action. Now, with that said, I want to show you what I've been noticing. So price action has been actually consolidating, okay? I know I know people don't like to hear this, but price action has been consolidating within this region. And now it starts coming down here to a very interesting area um, that I have noted in previous videos. But we have a minor imbalance or price gap here with back-to-back uh, -back order blocks this area here is one order block and then another order block um, right next to one another. So we have an area of confluence with some block flow. Now when, when price comes back to this area, it's not a guarantee that it's going to react from this area. However, we actually can see that price did react from this area here. And now that it did that, the very next two candles, or three candles in fact, did not even exceed the wick and price just slowly, gradually went down a little bit long, uh, further, smacked the exact order block, and then went sideways. Now, this sideways consolidating movement that we can see here is interesting because when I show you guys what the RSI was saying is different from what price action was doing. As we see here, price action was creating equal lows, but the RSI had started pushing to the upside, creating a bullish divergence. And now, what I want to bring even more um, awareness on is we can see clearly here, right, that we were in a consolidating on the RSI. Even in the RSI, if you want to say here, this was a consolidation area, it already broke out up here and then came back. I, I don't believe that. I believe this was a top. Here's a second top. This is a third touch. And then we have the break. So we were consolidating within price action within this potential um, triangle formation. And again, here on the RSI, we were um, trending and consolidating as well, not trending, but we were consolidating in a um, in the same the same type of consolidation we see in price action here is the same type of consolidation we see within the RSI here. The key difference is this area here. The key difference is this area here. Here on the weekly, we can actually see clearly that price action on the RSI, I'm sorry, the RSI has blasted through this resistance. But when we look at price action up here, it has not yet followed through with the move of the RSI. So with that, I believe with the bullish divergence, with the area of interest then consolidating market that we had above our area of interest being the fact that we got knocked down over here because of uh, fundamental news and a negative um in a negative uh way right we were in a technical uptrend and a bullish technical market we had some bad fundamental news come in that halted the 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 technical move okay and because of that price fundamentally dropped to the low end of the technical uptrend and i'm speaking this because technical analysis is very unique where fundamental uh, what a lot of times fundamental analysis will, will affect the market short term and
and technical analysis or technical move will correct itself and come to be eventually. Whether that short term be a week or a month or a year, it will be determined on you know this this the particular movement. In this case, uh, using XRP as the example, we had fundamental bad news about a year ago, but on the scale of things, you know this is 15 year market, one year out of 15. It's not going to really crush us, but what we're noticing and what we're starting to notice is here, now that we're moving away from the support area, the area of interest, and we've the RSI has blasted through this resistance, now price action shall follow. Now the unique thing about this is when price action follows, there's really not there's no no saying where it's going to go, right? There's not really a significant area of resistance once we start breaking out. Now, profit taking areas for a typical trader that is trading to make profits, I'm sure they're going to start taking profits maybe here at 87 cents, which is a an, an amazing move, guys. It's it really is from here to here. That's uh you know, 80% move, 78%. Now, others might say, I'm going to hold off a little higher and wait for the dollar thirty touch. Then we have the ones that are a little more optimistic who are saying, I'll just hold it until we get to the dollar sixty. Now, what happens when we blast through a dollar sixty, ladies and gentlemen, is going to be an amazing, an amazing, an amazing view okay because once we blast that 160 area we have a wick high of 330 on some exchanges it went as high as 380 i know i was there i was the one that sold here at 25 cents or i'm sorry down here at 25 cents and then price made an exponential rally to the upside of something along the lines of that massive percentage okay now When we squeeze in this market, and this was this move was based off of speculation. This move was anticipation rejected from fundamental analysis. Came back down, is following a strong uptrend and holding the support, and now starting to move away from that support. Now, what I'm looking at on the bigger picture is what does this actually look like now ladies and gentlemen for those of you that let me delete that for those of you that may or may not know this is a very bullish formation when it comes to uh, technical analysis and chart patterns okay this is what we call a w now if the w breaks to the upside, right? So if we break to the upside and price starts to rally higher, we could be potentially targeting a $6.39 XRP token. Ladies and gentlemen, that is what I see. That is my analysis. I do believe we're going to get this exact move and what's going to help skyrocket this push here not only the use case behind it the foundation is built do your due diligence on xrp guys i know there's going to be a lot of trash talkers in the chats because a lot of people are not educated a lot of people are bitcoin maxis a lot of people are ethereum lovers ladies and gentlemen utility will always rule utility will be the reason and that that is going to create that that wealth right i'm not saying it's going to be XRB, but what if it is based off the utility and the foundation that the Ripple company has built for XRP following the fundamental good news? So we had some fundamental bad news here, but now we're starting to get fundamentally good news. And as this court case rounds to the end, being at the bottom is probably going to be the best scenario we'll ever see again with this particular um, 
asset class and this specific currency. Um, XRP, truly believe, will rally to blast this area. And then again, like I said, we'll be targeting between $2.80 to $3.30. This will be where I'll be taking personally 50% of my profits and then I will take the remaining profit at $6.39 area, $6 and a quarter area. After we get this push up, we could have an ABC correction. The price will revisit some lows and some previous areas of interest, which would make sense if price revisited this dollar sixty area in the future because at this time when price action is up here in, in the future it'll look back in the past and realize that this area was a significant area in the scheme of things one breaking out so while breaking out price action blasted through the, the 130 to 160 region and then will run right up to the 280 and then six dollars and thirty cent range so I hope you guys for those of you guys that are XRP and the XRP army and love XRP token. Hope you guys are getting excited because we do have some fundamentally good news coming out. And I know that, you know, we're all been we've all been waiting for this court case to just end. Hold your head strong. Get ready because ladies and gentlemen, the RSI is already telling us that price is already broke out. Price action's yet to break out. Get ready. It's coming. Appreciate you all. I'll see you guys on the next one. First stop, 87 cents. Second stop, $1.31. Third pit stop, 160 before blast off. 260 to 280. 330 will be a profit taking area where we may see a pullback. But, ladies and gentlemen, don't get twisted if you see XRP just blast off from the $3 range to $6 and above. Appreciate you guys. See you guys on the next one. Hashtag XRP. Hashtag XRP Army. Hashtag appreciate you all. See you on the next one.